how do you recommend companies go about selecting a third party administrator? Big decision. That's a key point. So the third party administrator is, is really going to replicate all of the things, all of the functions that your insurance carrier does, plus provide you with transparent reporting that's going to help you make informed decisions about um, you know, how to adjust your benefits and how to save additional dollars moving forward. So it's a, it's a big, big choice. Um, and it, it's something that people rush and, and oftentimes botch. So um, first things first is make sure you've got the right advisor or broker um, you know, that you're working with. Make sure that they've got experience in the space. Make sure that they're um, not just beholden to one particular third-party administrator or carrier, um, you know, that they've got some uh, worldview about, you know, how certain TPAs or, you know, carriers might be a, you know, a better fit, uh, you know, given your unique circumstances and just be comfortable with that, that relationship that you've got the right person there. Um, and, and that's also important because, you know, your advisor is going to be collaborating with that administrator quite a bit. There needs to be some familiarity and, and, and some comfort there. So, um, you know, again, make sure you've chosen your, you know, your advisor, uh, you know, consultant, broker, partner um, wisely. Uh, second piece would be to um, uh, interview multiple candidates. Um, you know, when you're buying off the shelf insurance products, meeting with the carrier or carrier reps isn't always that crucial. Um, because you know, you're going to pay them a premium, they're going to administer their benefits, and you know a lot of times that that's it. Uh, in, in the self-funded space, you're going to be dealing with people at the third-party administrator, um, their service reps on a more frequent basis, asking more of them, frankly. Uh, and then so you want to have a good rapport and, and a good feeling about those individuals uh, as, as well that you're going to be working with on an ongoing basis. So those those would be the two things.